Hello everybody, Johnny Highland here in Camp Highland Studios in Nashville, Tennessee, which is my lovely studio. And uh, we just got finished with rehearsals for the uh, upcoming Dallas Guitar Show 2015. So I want to give you a sneak peek into what we're doing this year outside of just playing shows. we got a new tour that we're trying to get going. And uh, look, I have a brand new cowboy hat coming out with Atwood Hats, which I'm really excited about. We're going to meet them in Dallas. But while we're in rehearsals, you know I love to dress comfortable. But nobody has ever seen my brand new pedal board yet. So I think I'm going to give you the first sneak peek. TJ, follow on down to the floor, buddy, where I keep all my goodies. All right, folks, here is the beautiful new Johnny Highland pedal board. First of all, let me tell you this. It's a Pedal Train Pro, and we start off by powering everything with the brand new Voodoo Lab Mondo, which I am in love with. So that's powering everything. Now... Let's start over here. From guitar in, we have the brand new Go-Go Tuner. Guys, this is the caliber. It's amazing. Check this out. If we tune the E, if it's green, you're in. Let me put it a little sharp. Oh, if it's red, you're out. So I have that running into the new MXR Custom Shop Law Machine. I like running that with this guy right here, which is my new signature Johnny Highland Grumble Box by Metal Pedals. So let me show you how the new fuzz sounds. It's an octave fuzz when the little orange light on the top is on, T. So check this out. All right. So now, folks, we're moving on from the... So it goes from the tuner into the fuzz and then up to the Boss CS3 compressor. We move from, in, from that, from the CS3, into the exotic RC booster, which is essentially... A pedal that gives me extra boost for my clean tone, which is great, but it also allows me to change the uh, parameters of the of the highs and the lows, which I love that pedal. This is the new Johnny Highland Grumble Box, and guys, Dave from Metal Pedals, metalpedals.com, uh, actually, he has designed both of these pedals for me, and these are right in a row. This is the Grumble Box. This is actually... A pedal that will give you a lot of the dumble sounds, like the old blues cats love. Check it out. And then we move over to the JH3. And the JH3 was the first pedal that Dave designed me. And I love this pedal too. It's a screamer, guys. You can do all kinds of cool, heavy gain tones. <laughs> It's an amazing pedal. I truly love it, especially for the country sound, you know. It's really, really nice. One of my secret weapons. It's the pedal just above it that's on its side. It's actually called the ISP Decimator 2. And guys, i got to tell you, it takes all the excess noise out of your rig. Now, I'm going to move down to the next pedal in the chain, which is the new Digitech Mosaic pedal, which I truly, truly love. Because what it does is it gives you that uh, that twelve string sound. So after we get out of the uh, mosaic mode, let's get into DLS world, folks. DLS makes some amazing, amazing pedals. The first one that I love that brother Dave from uh, DLS makes is this uh, pedal right here called the Versa Vibe. And guys, for you folks that love the old Hendrix tone, <laughs> so as you can hear folks, the Versa Vibe is amazing. It gives you that really true kind of Hendrixy tone. Now, let's move on to one of my favorite pedals in the entire world. This pedal is called the Roto Sim, made by DLS as well. Now, we're going to move up from there into the to the newest pedal that I just uh, acquired 
from T from the kind folks at TC Electronic. Uh, my buddy Tobias and Tor, all those guys are just amazing. They hooked me up with the Flashback X4. <laughs> goes out to my amp is the Hardwire RV7, which is a reverb pedal. Now, as you can see on the on the RV7, I have it set to the old classic spring verb. Now, TJ, you're kind of down there. Could you reach with your first finger and turn the very first knob to the left on the RV7? All right, TJ has turned it up now, folks. Now, as you can hear, it gives you that old that old surf sound. <laughs> like real, true, old-school spring reverb, and I love it.